I just want to explain the checklist before we meet on Wednesday. So the homework for the week was to start revising your body paragraphs, look at the comments on your paper. You're going to have about three weeks to rewrite this essay, add some evidence, and make it perfect. So speaking of evidence, one part of your homework was to read and listen to this video tutorial I made on guidelines for choosing evidence and to find an example of each type of evidence from the preface of catching up or leading the way. However, reading through the preface I noticed he doesn't really use the four types of evidence. So what I want you to do is go back to your paper, the essay you just turned in, and find examples of those four types of evidence. And then write the purpose for each of those bits of evidence. And you're going to turn this in to me on Wednesday. Okay? So again, you're looking at your paper. You're going to find Einstein evidence, example evidence, fact evidence, and undocumented evidence and you're going to write the purpose for each of those bits of evidence, why you chose those types of evidence for your paper and your ideas specifically. Okay? If you have questions about that assignment, email me. You're also reading the preface of Catching Up or Leading the Way. Um, Annotate it. It's pretty dense, but it's really rich with new information. Um, and I just posted the quiz on the preface. And there are a lot of questions about the content as well as evidence and purpose of evidence. So make sure you do that. I'm actually going to have and state a time limit this week for the quiz. So you're going to have an hour and a half to do that. So make sure once you start the quiz, you finish it within an hour and a half because I noticed some people have been taking two to three days to do the quizzes and I don't really want that. I really want to see um, if you're reading and comprehending what you're reading, okay? Also, you are posting to the discussion forum. It's a writing reflection. I want you to talk about the process you went through in writing your last paper, how you felt, what you think you did well, what you could do better, and also offer some advice to your classmates. And lastly, I posted a couple of resources on MLA, and I want you to read through these resources. They're listed under this week eight. Um, template and just by reading those you'll be more prepared for our library session where we're going to start finding some articles to support your last paper. Alright guys, let me know if you have any questions and I'll see you Wednesday.